Lucasville Games and Quantic Dream, the award-winning video game studio and publisher, unveiled Star Wars Eclipse with a world premiere cinematic reveal trailer at the Game Awards 2021. While the trailer doesn't offer much in terms of details about the game itself, the trailer features new and familiar faces that are enough for us to speculate about. The trailer begins with an unknown, Voldemort-looking species, who appear to be summoning something through a drum ritual. We then see various new locations, including what looks to be a cross between Naboo and the Ring of Khafrein. Inside a marketplace that looks to be on the same planet are a wide variety of species, including a Mon Calamari and Duros. We get a look at Yoda inside the Jedi Temple, suggesting a Jedi connection to the game story. Four individuals reminiscent of Jedi pilgrims also appear to be in the same marketplace as before. We are then taken to what looks to be a new Jedi Temple, where two human-like Jedi are locked in lightsaber combat together, one with a green blade and one with a blue blade. The next location reminds me a bit of Kashyyyk, with this mixture of nature and man-made structures. We then see a group of starfighters flying by a large fortress with a Y symbol on the side of it, the same symbol that appears on various soldiers throughout the trailer. A Nemoidian makes an appearance along with a Lucra Hulk class battleship that can be seen later, suggesting the Trade Federation's involvement in the game. The army of soldiers with the Y logo mentioned before then appear followed by tanks and other weaponry. The same ships seen flying past the fortress then appear again when they seem to be attacking multiple Lucre Hulk battleships above a planet's atmosphere. If I had to make a prediction, I would say that the main conflict that will start off the game story will be between the Trade Federation and whatever group that the soldiers with the Y logo belong to. The official Star Wars Eclipse website gives more details about the game itself, describing it as an intricately branching ad action-adventure game that can be experienced in multiple ways, putting the destinies of an array of playable characters in your hands. Your choices will be at the heart of the experience, as every decision can have a dramatic impact on the course of the story. As the first video game to be set in the era of the High Republic, the multimedia initiative that launched with publishing earlier this year, Star Wars Eclipse will feature an original story and unique new characters, each with their own paths, abilities, and roles to play in the tapestry of events that could alter the carefully balanced piece in an uncharted section of the Outer Rim. Star Wars Eclipse is currently in the early stages of development, with an expected release likely set for late 2023. While it's only a cinematic trailer and doesn't offer much information about the game, it's still gotten me very excited. The various books and comics part of the High Republic have all delivered so far, and it will be fun to develop more of the era through a gaming medium. It's been more than two years since the release of Jedi Fallen Order, and with no major game releases recently, Star Wars Eclipse gives fans something to look forward to. If the game looks anything like the trailer, the game will be well worth the wait. Make sure to like, subscribe, follow me on social media, and comment down below what content you'd like to see in the future. As always, thank you all for watching, and remember, The Force will be with you, always.